Hello friend, today we are going to learn how to create amazing science fiction movie poster in Photoshop. So let's begin our tutorial. First we are going to take a new document. So just click on file, then click on new, then take a document. You can choose any of this size and after selection just create, click on create button. So your document is ready. Now we are going to place some images. So first we are going to place our background image. So I think this one is my background image and this one is the perfect for my background. So I'm just take this one and drag and drop this one. Okay. Then again make duplicate this one and right click and transform and go to flip horizontal. After complete your work, just deselect this one. So this one is deselected. Our next work, we are going to place surface image. So I think this one is perfect for my surface. So just select this one by using polygon tool. So just simply select this one. okay then our next work we are going to just match the color of background and surface image so we are going to click on adjustment layer and go to hue saturation and this time i'm clicking on ma clipping mask layer and simply adjust the color So this one is almost done. Our next work we are going to place our model image. So where it is? Uh, so this one is our model image. So we are going to select this one by using paint tool because this one is the perfect tool for selection and also this one is my favorite tool for selection. So simply zoom your image by pressing Ctrl plus and start selection. So my friend this one is the very boring part so I am going to make my video a little bit faster. When you complete your placement just select this one one time more one again then when your selection is complete then click on select and mask layer click on refine edge brush tool and just simply increase the size of your brush by using bracket key and we are going to apply this brush in this that areas it's help you to select difficult areas of hair. So this one is completed. After when you complete your selection, just click on decontaminated color 
go to output to new layer then press ok control minus to zoom out your image and our next work we are going to make a little bit more adjustment on camera raw so just select your model and go to filter and camera raw and start your adjustment and press ok so we can see that our background and our model is almost matched so we are going to add some shadow to provide a realistic look because shadow is very important part it's provide any image realistic look so take a blank layer go to brush make opacity 100% and make foreground color black and simply apply in that area make this one little bit flatter so this one is flatted So our basic work is almost completed. Our next work we are going to use brush tool to make light behind our model image. So just click on this area, take a mask layer, take a blank layer and go to brush and we are going to simply apply this white color. this one is done and our another work we are going to make a little bit more adjustment in our model image first we are going to select this one and take a blank layer go to filter uh, blending mode and select inner dots to add and go to solid color and select white clipping mask select click on layer and just go to blending options and simply adjust it then press ok click on mask layer to take paint bucket to make foreground color black and apply this then again click on mask layer and go to brush and this time we are going to add some light in upper surface of our model Now we are going to adjust little bit light and shadow area. So we are going to take a blank layer, go to blending mode, select overlay, make this one clipping mask and go to edit and fill and this time we are going to select 50% gray then press ok. Then click here and go to dodge tool and simply apply this. It's provide amazing glossy light.
and our next work we are going to add a lens flare so this one is the lens flare and just select this one and drag and drop this one and go to blending mode and select this one screening or you can also choose color dots Place this one behind our model. And adjust the color of this one. So just select our, we are going to change the color of this one. So just click on Hue Saturation, Clipping Mask and Colorized. This one is automatically changed. Now we are going to increase a little bit. saturation and we are going to provide red look so I think this one is perfect or okay blue is also looks good but I think orange is perfect and press ok then take mask layer go to brush and we are going to remove this areas. So our work is almost done and our final work we are going to make little bit changes on camera raw adjustment. So we are going to camera raw adjustment first we are going to merge the complete layer into a one layer. So what we have to do we just click the upper layer and hold shift control alt plus E. So we can see that the complete work is merged into a one layer and now we are going to convert this one into a smart object so this one is converted and now we are going to make little bit changes in camera raw so just select on click on filter go to camera raw and we are going to make little bit changes so we are going to adjust the color of our work first we are going to decrease the So the work is completed so my friend if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel see you soon with a new tutorial and goodbye